seen. There was a fish chasing minnows right there. Baby, it's the fish number one. Freaking watched him come up and just blam it. 16 inch. Watched him come up and just kerplunk. And get a couple more of those. That'd be pretty nice. Got him. Little guy. The smoke the spinner bait. You gave it a nice little poke. Little guy right there. Might have got hit right away. There he is. That's a good fish. Oh yeah. Look at that. That's why when you catch one, you spot lock. All right, let's get him in the boat. Boom. Look at that. Going back. Back this way, baby. Look at him. Look at him fight. Hey! Looks perfect there in the corner. Another good, good little cookie cutter. Another nice fish, folks. Spinner bait. Toss him back. I just gave it a little pop pop, let the let that skirt dance a little bit, and he crushed it. Come here, big girl. Look at that. That's the biggest one of the day so far. So you guys, I want you guys to, well, the hook just came out too, how convenient. So if you guys were paying attention to how I caught that fish, I was just slow rolling that spinner bait. And as I was slow rolling it, I, you know, I took it by the boat and I noticed how, how good it looks when you just give it a little pop pop. And obviously, I'm gonna give it a little drink real quick. Biggest one of the day. Did you guys see how I just gave that spinner bait a few little pops, you know, gave it a little pause. And as soon as I rinse and reel it back in, it was already in his mouth. That's what's up. Let's toss this one right back in. So, you know, so I'm gonna show you guys, I was reeling it in slow. I lift my rod up, I give it a few pops. I kind of let that skirt dance and then I just kind of slowly get it back into action. Pause it, give it a few little pops. But as you're popping it, you're kind of keeping a little bit of tension with it. You know what I mean? So if something does give it a little nibble, something does kind of suck it in, you got a little clue to it. So again, reel it in a little bit, 
get it in motion, feel it out. Then I, this is how I do it. You can either pop it like this, but I don't like that. I like to grab the rod and kind of let that skirt dance. It's the juice, guys. Oh my God. You don't want to lose this guy. Let him give him some line. Whew. All right, let's focus on the fish. Try to get you guys a good angle on him. Oh yeah, he crushed it. Bring the big end back this way. Oh, 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 we're messing up. Here we go. Come here, big girl. Yeah. Look at that. Oh my goodness, did she crush that spinner bait. Look how it crushed the spinner bait. My goodness. We like that bussy woods, baby. Whew. Let's put him back. That one knocked some slack into it. He hit it how I like. He hit it how I like. Oof. Oof, he's pissed. He's ready to go. Look. Man. We on him. Another one. Oh, this is the big. No, it looked well. Look at that one right there, folks. Oh my rod. Look at that one right there. Smoked it. Plusy Woods. Just throw him back. First cast with the wacky worm. Biggin. Oh my God. On the wacky. We want the net for this one. That's a giant. I, I went to set the hook and it was already in his mouth because he sucked it in. Yeah, dude. That's a big one. That is a big one. That might be 19 inches. Come on, y'all. Barely touching it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The big one right there. Public Lake Slob. Post spawn though, man. Look at him. He's not paper thin. He's starting to eat, but he wishes he he wishes he had that wacky worm too. <laughs> That's a giant. Not a giant, but if he was filled out, he'd be four pounds. Let's put him back. He's fired up. He's fired up. Yeah, the wacky worm is the move, huh? Huh. We're having fun. All right, folks, we're getting packed up. Great day out here on Bussy Woods. 
hope I showed you guys, the local guys who actually know where I am. Man, you can come out here to your local horse preserve, your public lakes, and you can hammer them. Those of you who are new to my channel or aren't local, hope you enjoyed some of that Illinois bass fishing and realize that Illinois isn't just a Chicago cesspool. There is some good fishing to be had out here as well. So yeah, spinner bait, wacky worm, it's all we needed. My boy Matt was over there throwing some bladed jigs, some Texas rigs, crossed them on the frog too, which was great. I kind of wish I brought the frog, but I'm really enjoying this new rig. If you haven't already, go check out my setup video of that. I'll leave a link down below in the description if you guys want to see what I'm rocking with, kind of see my full setup. And yeah, that's going to do it for me today, guys. Like I said, great day out here on Bussy Woods, Cook County, Chicago fishing. Doesn't get any better. See you guys in the next one.